could you deliver the goods every day for a year to please your man? Well, <laughs> well, when Charla Muller's husband turned 40, she decided to treat him to every night for a year as a birthday present. In her book, 365 Nights, although it felt longer, in <laughs> which tells the story of their frisky year, she says it improved their relationship, even if she couldn't be bothered at times, although all I wanted to do was crawl under the covers and sleep. I realized sometimes you got to do it even when you don't want to. It was like spending Christmas with your in-laws or cheering on a football team. You couldn't care less. I'm sure he's thrilled about this. <laughs> so, is, is this something that we'd ever like to try? What do we reckon? No. <laughs> Nor would I particularly like to read about her frisky year, particularly. <laughs> It'd be the same um, every page, every page. Today we had sex. Today yeah. we had sex. Today we had sex. Today, we had today sex. you know, every single day. And today it'd be like, and I was, you know, that he was on. I was learning his script. I was on about that. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, I can't think of anything worse. To, to be, to be honest. I mean, I do, I do think that. <laughs> I do think that sometimes I should put out a bit more <laughs> when I don't want to. And I am guilty of hearing those. And Tim, Tim, right, Tim has a thing. I know he's rehearsing today, so he won't be watching. Tim, Tim has a thing whereby he, I know when he wants, when he wants Jiggy Jigs, because he goes, oh. I just know that he does. So what do you do? Well, I start going, oh, I've got a really, oh. <laughs> to, to oh, yes, if it's, if it's just... early bedtime, I run upstairs and go, <laughs> 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 I do, because I'm just too knackered with my plate spinning. <laughs> no, listen, why don't you should just, just let him have it. Shut <laughs> up. In 30 bleeping years, you come to me and say, let him have it. <laughs> no, listen, I would. I can't, you know, obviously at the moment, I can't imagine, you know, not wanting oh, not to die with the <laughs> Well, exactly, but, you know, poor Tim. I, I, how can he you does get here trying to make yourself look unattractive just so he won't I don't want to have sex with you? I don't. Well, Quick, it doesn't get me work tracking on the scarf, the gloves, the socks, everything. Oh, hello, Tim. Do you want some? <laughs> Luckily, he's not as, luckily, he, as he's got older, his sex drive isn't quite as high, because there was a time when I literally couldn't put a dish in the dishwasher. <laughs> no, without him seeing that as a sign. It, well, honestly. Well, you know, I know how you feel. I used to literally go in the dishwasher and put the dishes in the Denise, in, in Carol's defence, do you, do you remember last year when, when we were building the house and, and it was, you know, Grumpy Gate, when he was a bit, bit grumpy, and we had this conversation last year and I was going, you know, I can't believe it, you know, he's, he's really grumpy but he's still expecting, you know, and I'm thinking, well, you're grumpy, what? and you said, well, yep. Can I just say you're you're kind of right. Even yeah. if you know you if you kind of psych did, yourself said, up and, and give it to him, and he we're a lot happier. <laughs> and he wasn't, was was he? It's it was made he? a big difference. Top feminist Carol McGiffin. <laughs> well, why don't you want to? I don't understand. No, I do sometimes want to. I'm just really? saying I should sometimes put out a bit when I don't then. want to. <laughs> Jane McDonald, you're being very quiet. Oh, I'm always. <laughs> I think Jane does do it every day, every day when they're together, which is about yeah. five days a year. That's right. true. <laughs> yeah, she just does it 365 times. Time. Exactly, <laughs> non-stop. And, uh, and it's funny because our schedules are so busy, as you know, Ed's on tour with the searches, I'm on tour with, and doing this and everything else. So we've actually sort of talked ourselves into not, you know, back when he gets back, I'll say, look, I'm going to be asleep, blah, 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 as soon as he gets in. There you go. What can I do? He's, he's, as soon as he gets... Because oh, you, stop you love Ed, don't you, Jane? I do. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> yes, I do. I do. I, I do. Like do. She does. But, I love it very much. But I've always, I've always said, make and beg. You know, it's, yes. You know, I think a bit of abstinence and they're very grateful when they do get it. Yeah. No, 
so I mean... Do you know, I thought you said absence. I was going to say that. <laughs> not allowed. No, it isn't, love. Absence <laughs> makes it hard to ponder. I'll tell you what, when you haven't had it for seven years, once a day ain't enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's